Okay, this video is on how to import an existing wallet that you have somewhere else into a SafePal wallet. Now, we're going to pretend that I don't have any wallets in my SafePal, uh, but I actually have uh, several. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to go up to the top. You see where it says debt JQU. I'm going to click on that down arrow right next to it. And it's going to display the wallets that I have um, added to my SafePal account. And I'm just going to click uh, on uh. add wallet. And I'm going to add a software wallet. So I'm going to click on, on that and I'm just going to create a um, new wallet. Let's click on that. I'm going to create a new wallet. I'm going to do it by mnemonic phrase or I'm going to do it by private key or by key store or by observation mode or I can restore from Google Drive. I'm going to do it by mnemonic phrase because I have the mnemonic phrase of my existing wallet and I'm just going to use that mnemonic phrase and import it in to SafePal. Now what you need to understand is that you aren't mm -hmm. moving crypto or tokens anywhere when you import an existing wallet. All, all you're doing is providing another way to represent the tokens that you have that are already sitting on the blockchain. The wallet gives you access to that crypto uh, uh, as long as you have the mnemonic phrase or the private key. It gives you access to that crypto that's sitting on the blockchain. If you don't have the mnemonic phrase, then you do not have access to the crypto that's sitting on the blockchain. So you aren't moving it or transferring it to the safe power wallet, all you're doing is a, a, a this is giving you access to it from a different wallet. So I'm going to click by mnemonic phrase and I'm just going to go ahead and put in my uh, the safe power security password. So I put in my safe power security password and I'm going to enter uh, my mnemonic phrase. Now it it it's it's either 12 15 18 21 or 24 words and i'm going to enter them and i'm going to separate each of the words with a space and you need to do this in order so in the order that you kept your mnemonic phrase or when you created that other wallet you need to it needs to be in the exact same order or it will not work so all I'm going to do is just put in the new mnemonic phrase. I'm going to name my wallet something. And the import button is going to be highlighted. And then all I'm going to do is just click import. And that's all that's to importing an existing wallet into SafePal. <laughs> 